we would get that. Um, I knew that I was very confident that I would have gotten that scholarship, but however, I was very shocked that I received the presidential medal, but my board is an honor board, so he just keeps adding, so I'm really happy for it. You spoke a little bit about the difficulty that you faced uh, growing up when you lost your dad. Give us an idea of what you really went through and how difficult it was for you. Um, well, I would have been living alone with my dad at the time in 2019 and I was very close with him. So he passed away suddenly from cardiac arrest and it was really hard for me at the time. However, I used it as a point of motivation because my dad was always the one who would encourage me to continue pursuing, pursuing school. I couldn't even miss a day at that point in time. So I kept that um, mood, basically that mood of and I moving forward that I would have continually been focused on my school work at all times. Well, at first it was hard to maneuver. However, after settling down in Bahrain, Cuba at the time, I was able to focus on myself and my schoolwork better because I had a strong support system with me. So your father, you look good. Would your father give us a little bit of help in that role? Well, I had grown up with my mom until I was 12 years old, but then she had to move back to Guyana, so I ended up living with my dad. However, my dad and I were always very close since I was born. Can you give us some of advice? My mode of advice would be to submit to board first and foremost and follow after this teaching and all things will be made clearer to you. So that's my biggest advice and also to just remain dedicated to have living faith, which is filled with actions and I will see the results in here. Vicky, before you go, I just want to find out what's next for you and in terms of profession, what you want to do. Well, right now I'm pursuing human resource management at the University of the West Indies St. Augustine campus. And that was my um, path at the time, my selected path. However, now that this new opportunity has been presented, I will be seeking after what board wants me to do first and foremost, and then I will be able to decide.